So welcome back guys to yet another uh, Sam Story walkthrough gameplay here. Uh, this is part 6. Like I keep saying in my previous episodes, I will have the... What was that? Huh. <laughs> I will have... Uh, sorry, I got I got. I don't know. Sidetracked. Anyways, I, I will have the uh, part 5, the previous uh, video, on the top right hand corner of the screen. Or in the description, one of the two places. Um, at the moment, we're trying to help this local with his brother. Apparently, he screwed him over, to, over um, from a dealership way before the war began. So, I'm not so sure. We're just going to go check out those question marks. Alright, so let's go ahead and check these two question mark places right here on the map and help this dude out. His code, apparently, is 1, 2, 3, 4... Very simple. We have to beat it out of his brother, apparently. Um, though... Do I need the boat? I don't know. Uh, there's a boat on that side. Not sure if I need it. Mmm, I think we'll just leave it be for now. <laughs> and see what happens. Because, I mean, there's a lot of land and stuff like that, so we should be good. Okay. careful with these guys too. Alright, so let's go... Can I go back up here? I might actually be able to cross over if there's a bridge or so. Let's go ahead and check that out. Not sure if I can sink in there. Huh. That's another question mark. Something else. Can I cross over? I feel like I'm gonna fall in, into the water. a workbench. Alright. Let me go ahead and do something with it real quick. Okay, we should be good to go. So I could actually sleep here. I'm not sure if these guys are enemies. I don't think so. But, uh... There is something greedy on this side. Can't go through there. Oh, we don't want to mess with that. 
Not yet, anyways. <laughs> How did you? Who the hell are you? Name's Sam. I'm working for Tom. Ah, I know you. I saw you there. So, you are second American, huh? Ah, I heard you're supposed to be around. Well, come here. We'll show you what's what. We are hey. gold scouts for nothing after all. What's up, what's up, guys? What's up? What you got for me? Huh. So, first of all, beware of the bat wing roaming about. We haven't seen it, just heard it. And judging by its shouts, it's huge and angry as hell. And probably it's wounded. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Next, where did you need to go? To the fire depot. You can see it from here. The red building with a tower. It's about half a click from here as the crow flies. Right. But you don't look like a crow. It's close. But it's gonna be hard to get there. <laughs> yeah. Crows have it easy in these parts. Look. That unfinished building from before the war. You need to go through it. That's the only way to the upper bog where the fire depot is right now. There's a gang that set up shop there, though. They used to do some slave trade. But lately, they switched to the latest thing and started catching those human-like mutants. Can you imagine that? We've been at odds with them since forever. And okay. They, they never like strangers. They're sure to open fire as soon as they see you. Don't expect the warning. So, try to remain unseen. Thank you. I will. What okay, else cool. have we got here? Ah, here. Look this way now. See that two-story tower-like building on that islet? It used to be a police post before the war. Now oh, it's okay. taken over by a gang, too. Complete mad lads. Though they're busy catching the fuglies now, like the others. That business is on the rise over here, you know? What they have there is a warehouse of sorts. So there should be some good loot there. <laughs> that little islet supposedly houses a cache of sorts. A few years back, a new gang appeared in this town. Those were some crazy bastards, but they were good. They went and demanded tributes from gangs thrice their numbers, and murdered everyone who didn't pay up. They had training, spitznats like. They also had gear, hmm. like in the movies, armor, guns. Each of them had night vision, too. <laughs> they had a good run, ended up controlling a huge swath of the ruins, even with their numbers. Then the other gangs decided they had enough, got together and smashed them completely. So all that remains of them today are their caches marked by their sign. A skull wearing night vision goggles. So okay. watch out for those. Why? I bet all those places were looted long ago. I wouldn't be so sure. Those guys were real show-offs. Each of their caches is like a puzzle box. The chosen ones in the know are supposed to get it. While random Joes like us are not. Huh. The boys did find hidden buttons opening doors a couple of times. But all through sheer luck, they never got the principle. Perhaps you'll get it after looking at the situation with your unbiased American eye. <laughs> hmm, I might. You forgot the Fuglies. Ah, yes. Watch out on that islet with the cash. The Fuglies are especially large and tough there. I've no idea why, and I don't care. But these large ones are in demand, so the hunters don't clear them out. They just catch a couple from time to time and leave the rest to repopulate. Okay. Got it. So that's about it. We've been told to observe and render assistance if needed. We told you what we know. That should count. Thanks, guys. Good luck. Okay, so it's a lot of stuff you can actually go for. Interesting. Okay, so in the map, I'm just looking at this. On the bottom, all the way at the bottom of the screen, there's like this helmet. That could be a place to go, but I'll have to go all the way around on this side if I don't have my little boat. I don't know if I should take the boat. I feel like I'm going to be really, really uh, exposed, but we should definitely check those places out. Uh, they did have something here. So, uh, I believe you can actually get extra ammunition with that vest. Let's go ahead and clear this. Ooh, it's not... Sorry, that's a uh, it's camera mode right there. OK, 
Okay, so there, I don't know if there's like a little bridge or so. There is a bridge. Okay, cool. I don't know if I should, should equip this vest on or not. Um, Let's see what we got here. Throwing weapons, I got that currently equipped. Ammo pouches. Well, the wearer is in motion. Okay, let's go ahead and use that. Okay, cool. I wanna, eh, there we go. You have to be careful though. Um, There are some bandits and stuff around and apparently it's well guarded. So we're gonna go ahead and check that out real quick. Actually, use my shotgun here. All right, so gotta be careful here. So apparently, I believe in the episode, not episode, but video five, number five of this series, uh, I found like this uh, skull with night vision goggles. That's what he's talking about. Um, apparently, those guys were like very well trained of what I've, the guy told us. And they were very well trained and they got like a good amount of loot and stuff like that. So. Oh no. I made a huge mistake. Those out. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! No, no. There's a demon there. Oh, great! I'm letting him get close. Gotta be careful with these th these things. Out of here. There's a lot of dead guys here, so. Whoa! Can I not walk or so? Run? I'll we'll have to defeat this thing then. Jump or anything. I'm probably need to defeat this guy. Ooh. Gotta be careful with those bat things too. Oh, where's this dude at? Where's this dude at? Oh, it's not. I believe he's trying to corner me in. Here. Thing looks ugly. <laughs> okay, where is it at? Where is it at? There he is. How many I got? Seven. Still got a good amount. Run by Gotta get out of this place. I'm gonna reload real quick. Oh This is not a good place to be. Ah come on. Uh, let's try this again. I don't see a place to get 
out of here. By the looks of it. over here. This is right here. Uh. Ooh. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need to heal up after that one. <laughs> They might actually feel like a little bait or so. Let me go real quick. He's up here now. Oh snap, he's not giving me any cover. Where is he? I can't shake him off or anything. That's the bad thing about it. Oh, man. Alright. Third time's the charm, hopefully. Uh, I might actually use, I don't know, I want to use this, how much of incinerary rounds we got, 34 and 59, and then just a shotgun, and a pistol, okay, one more time, one more time, <laughs> let's see, let's see, let's see. That's kind of remind me of a uh, Gears of War. I forgot what were they called. Gears of War, the first one, where there's like this level that you had to shine like light on it for those bats or so to not chew you up or so. I forgot what they were called though. Still catch me? Oh, this side, this side, this side. All my meds on this one. These bats coming back again. Just to cover here. Let's 
heal up. Oh, we're gonna use all of them. That still got me. Come on. What in the world? Gonna do a little thing, my dude. Oh, last one. Oh, snap. Oh, no, we're gonna get. Oh, this dude is a big boy. <laughs> oh, snap. Those mutants kill each other. Alright, I think I'm low on, uh... Yeah, we're definitely low on the rifle right here. Okay, we got a little bit more. Let's reload. Got some shotgun ammo here. Just done on this side. Gotta be careful. Hopefully that dude does not come back, because I don't have a lot of... Well, I don't have any uh, med kits at all. Oh, snap. This is no bueno. No good. Here's a guy. Let's see if we can find any more dead bodies around. We can search for some ammunition. I'm going to use a shotgun for now. Hightail it to a place that's well sheltered. Can this helps do it? Or not? You don't want to be in this. You don't want to be in this storm for whatever reason. Apparently, it's dangerous, but I don't want to know. Snap. Yeah, we definitely do not want to be out here, out in the open. Uh. This is not a good spot. Careful with the mines here. Glad Tokarev taught me how to disarm those. Can we take shelter here? Let me see my Geiger counter oh. meter here. I think we should be safe. Here. And there are some mines around, so I think we should be safe here. I don't want to go out. Well, I guess I'm stuck here now. <laughs> Just gotta be careful with these mutants too. one there. I 
I really do not want to engage him whatsoever. I guess I'm stuck here until the storm passes, which I do not know how long it is. But, uh... I don't know. I don't want to get out of, out of this, because apparently I think a lightning or two struck one of those mutants, so... I don't want to be out there. I guess I'm going to just sit tight until that pa until this passes, but, uh... Well, I guess I'll just stop it there. <laughs> Very, very dangerous place we are in at the moment. Um, like I said, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Hit the like, subscribe, and um, I'll try to get out of here or so in the next one. I'll probably be somewhere else. Like I said, I'm not so sure how long this is going to last. But uh, anyway, so I'll see you guys in the next one.